Oh God! Yep, yep. They all filmed me doing that. <laughs> thanks, thanks. We're in North Dakota. It's August, and we're in the Sherp. Obviously, uh, it's four in the morning. Opening day, early honker. We got to cut cornfield. Oh, thank goodness for the Sherp. It is nasty, real nasty. They've gotten a lot of rain. Woo! <laughs> It is beautiful out, it's sitting at uh, right at 57 degrees. Absolutely gorgeous, perfect for that ducks hoodie. Again, I've been telling you guys, August 20th, the big drop from ducks waterfowl, this hat, all the duck and goose calls will be available. And as well as this shirt right here, this is the Fred shirt. That is Fred with a woody in his mouth from last season. Yeah, oh yeah, gotta pick it up. It's on the site and available August 20th. But here we are, we're getting after it. Sitting out the dive bomb silos. We got a lot of guys with us. <laughs> dive bomb is with us. Three of them, Nick, Asher, Cade. I think there's about nine or 10 of us total. But uh, if they all come, we're gonna kill a bunch of them. There was about 150, 180 honkers in this field last night. It's a corn field from last season. Let's get muddy, let's get busy. What do you think? I think the light's bright. <laughs> yeah, my light is a little bright, eh? You ready nice to go? Morning. Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready. Uh, old Bradley, he's wielding the SB3 today. Oh yeah, oh yeah. This is my new beauty. You guys haven't seen her yet. New Frankie three and a half. Yeah, buddy. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, well, here we are. Got the spread out in front of us. Beautiful. North Dakota sunrise. Yeah. Jordan, oh, here it is. good tank in the blinds. What are you doing? You sighting her in, getting ready, or what? Uh, I'm not a Beretta guy. You know, I'm a, a vanilla guy. This is, it's a little different, but you know, we'll make it work for today, I guess. Right. There we go, it's on. It's on, boys. They're coming. They're coming. They're coming right here. Mm -hmm. They don't like us. Oh. Not our birds. Not our birds. <laughs> I knew that was coming. Ah, uh, well, we blew our lungs out. Classic. <laughs> yeah, classic. They would do that, right? Well, that's the first birds that have been up. What time is it? it is. Oh, excuse me. We've 741. been sitting here. 741. We've been sitting here munching, talking a bunch of BS. They hated us. There's another group coming over the hill. Are they coming? They're going still. They, they hate us. Yeah, we should have set the 80 dozen. Yeah, we should have said 80 dozen. <laughs> Seven. I don't know. It feels like goose season. Yeah, it does feel like goose season. You're right. I'm trying to make excuses. I'm trying to find something to say on here in the camera, you know. But uh, it's 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 early season. They can be. They can they can do what they want to do. Hey, first two groups hated us. Uh, we're thinking we're probably obviously way too loud. You know, first day everybody wants to hammer on the calls. Uh, we're gonna back off a bit. Give them the old silent treatment. See if it works. They do it yeah, they're, they're not loving it. Like, they're not loving it. They got other plants. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
I got my gun. <laughs> Hold on, let's go for me and you go look at Nicholas. Oh, you guys do not understand what just happened. We thought that we were done. We're all just gabbing. Group didn't even make a noise, came out of nowhere right over the hill, landed down the field here. What are you doing, man? What are you doing? Where are you going? Huh? You know one thing about it? It was a good hide, dude. It does look nice. It does. A-frames, everybody was in A-frames. We grassed them in. You couldn't grass them in literally any better. Did look nice. What's your, hold on, we, we need, what's your two cents on why, what, how, where, and when? Well, it's August and yeah. it's 100 degrees out. And they're either gonna really do it or they're gonna or they're be gonna weary go. and they're gonna be like, hey, we they're don't know what that, that is. Yep. You'll have that. You'll have those You'll days. Have You'll have those jobs. <laughs> oh, poor, poor men out there. Poor men. It happens. Might not have shot anything, but you know what? Woo, Matt got a new vehicle. Look at that beauty. Hey, what a gorgeous girl she is. That is a Can-Am thousand on tracks oh matthew oh good lord 4500 pound winch my goodness what a unit you always have these toys you always have these toys that make me want to start spending my money well the walk of shame i'm here at the shirt uh, i gotta make a, another jaunt uh, out in this muddy god awful field. This is a cornfield that wasn't cut last year and it went all winter and then they harvested it uh, recently. And boy, howdy, it is a mess. What do you do? What do you do? You win some, you lose some. You win many, you don't lose very many. Sometimes you win all of them, and then the next year you lose all of them. Who knows? Last year, the first hunt, or the first day, the second day was amazing. Complete bangers. The third day, we had a heck of a lot of trouble, like today. Today uh, was like the third day last year. So, uh, this trip, 2020, hey, hey, too, we were all joking about it, we are like, 2020 like all, all the memes about 2020 how bad it is look hey yeah you guys haven't even seen him yet uh oh frederick he's here nope i'm not hunting him i just brought him along for the trip so he could be with dad he can have fun he's been running around with the other dogs there's literally a total of five dogs so there's no reason uh for one there's no re oh i know buddy there's no reason that fred needs to work or, or hunt uh, there's plenty of other dogs and number two I actually wasn't really supposed to bring him but I already had him Brad nope get up here it's time it, it's obedience time right now hey right here set so he's got to listen sit while his buddies his new buddies go play sit but he's not hunting because I don't want him to break uh, Charlie and I have been working especially Charlie has been putting so much time and patience into Fred getting him from breaking so if I was to hunt shoot and run Fred he'd break I guarantee it so I don't want to start all over again but this morning was a botch complete cheeks uh, it happens sometimes they love you sometimes they hate hate you I think if we would have had I know I'm gonna I'll start hey you know me like always I'll start making excuses number one uh, they really liked after all they really liked the heavy calling I thought they didn't they actually did. We, the first two groups we called really heavy and they actually came to us. Uh, when we backed off the calling, that's when the first group hated us. They started going the opposite direction and then everything that lifted off the roofs after that followed them. So, I'm gonna go in and talk to the guys. Last night, uh, I found a feed of about 50 to 60 bursts, which makes a really small man shoot, four or five man shoot. I'm gonna see if the guys wanna do it and then if some other guys wanna scout, if they do it, they'll be. Uh, that's awesome. But if we don't do that, 
then we're gonna roll this video into the morning of day two. And by the way, it's not all about the kill. This place is amazing. We're sitting at 69 degrees right now, 70 degrees. Beautiful northwest wind. It's amazing. I got my dog, I got a bunch of my buddies, I got the Sherp. I don't really have to kill anything to have fun. Ooh, boy. Check this sunrise out. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Bring them in. Bring them in. Well, here's the hide situation today. Lay down blinds. Stuffed with uh, trash. This is a pea field. Dude, mosquitoes are a bad deal. Yeah, they're big. They're real big. They about carried me off a few times. Thick. They're thick. Thick. Real. Well, day two. Given, uh, taking another whack at her here. Day one. Well, you, you all seen what happened there. Day two, much different hide. Uh, lay down blinds. Stacked together. Uh huh. Thank goodness we found enough trash, pea trash here. Got us blinded down pretty good. I mean, it looks fairly good for being in the middle of a field. Bear field. Like, just dirt field. What are you thinking? What up? Table trying to, set. Trying to survive the mosquitoes. Yeah, dude, we're getting carried away out here. It's bad. It's bad. One thing about it, if we, if we, the first group, if we just get into them, man, this whole, this whole, all, how many is there here? One, two, three, nine. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. How did we all fit and make this look this good? I have no idea. But if we have any type of success today, you're going to hear us all come alive pretty good. Yeah, but yesterday you guys didn't get to see the new beauty very well. There she is. Ready for a nap. Right behind us. Old Mallard checking us out. Here we go, boys. Here we go. Oh, they're coming, boys. Here we go. Here we go, boys. Oh. Oh. What happened? Wow. Boys, I was not loaded. Wow. Wow, 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 Bobby guy. I didn't even have any shells in. Didn't even have any shells in, boys. That is my luck. Wow. Wow. That was bad. <sighs> we got a walker out front. Oh, that was bad. My bad, boys. Uh, I didn't load my gun. <laughs> oh boy. Wow. Well, the, the boys, they downed at least one, two, three, four birds. I pulled up, it went click. I pulled the bolt back. Didn't have a shell in it. Good going, Bob. That deserves a thumbs up, right? <laughs> oh, that was really good, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was. I pulled up. Click, pulled the bolt back, and it stayed back. Click. Yeah, and it times. clicked again. Times. Just kept clicking. That's my luck. Welcome to 2020, Nick. <laughs> oh, another group, another group. Oh my god. 
god. I clicked the first shot, that's awesome. Still haven't shot it. <sighs> Why did it click? Damn. Dude, it's like, it's just not meant Man, to be. not meant to be. Not meant to be. You're 0 for 2. Yeah, I'm 0 for 2. I'm like shaking them. I'm a little depressed, not, not gonna lie. But they both died. There we go. There we go. Smash a thumbs up. Give a give a brother some help out here. It'd be cool if one was banded. I definitely wouldn't get in that drawing contest. <laughs> the <camera> don't lie. <laughs> yeah, the camera don't lie. When the gun don't go off, the camera don't lie. That was good. That was awesome. That pair just came, kept coming and coming. They're basically dragging their feet, like Nick said, for the last hundred hundred yards. They wanted to land. They wanted to shortstop us again. Uh, so as they keep coming and the lower they get, you got to pick up the calling and just keep encouraging to keep coming. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. That was awesome. I wish I would have been able to shoot again, but no go. No go for Bob. I had to shoot two boys. <laughs> I connected. I connected! I connected and the gun works! Yes! <sighs> well, that felt good pulling the trigger. Woo! There we go. Yeah, single Steve did it. Yeah. Yeah, old Jack almost caught him. A little baby goose. It's so yellow. Yeah, it's a little early to be shooting these honkers here. There we go. That's all I needed. That's all I needed. A little w, double tappy. A little double tappy. We did it. We did it. Come on now. Nice. Oh. Oh, he's lifting. I should have pulled the trigger. <laughs> Jax is running. Jack is behind him. I didn't want to pull the trigger. Jack, dude, Jack is on him. He's still going. Oh, that's gonna be a retrieve right there. Jack stayed on him. What is? How far is he? Three hundred yards. Woo! Jack's still going after him. Well, one down for sure. Maybe two here. Well, it's pickup time. It's more ca There's more cameras out here than guns. Thank Gee, man, need Christmas. Look at look at Costas over here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Costas, get in there. That's it. That's the angle right there. Yeah. Give them more. Don't say anything raunchy. Okay, it's a clean channel, Costas. I didn't say anything. Watch your mouth. Come on. I didn't say what nothing. do you have to say? Happy to be here. <laughs> but here we go. Much better hunt than yesterday. Ten total. No, we didn't just kill every one of them in the world. But check out these big old dudes right here. Look how big these hunkers are. Massive. Massive guys right there. <laughs> oh my goodness. I want to show you guys something real quick. Oh yeah. There's that new ducks goose call right there. That's what I was blowing all day. I am loving it. <laughs> Love it, man. If you guys want to pick one up, they are available August 20th. I don't know if it's August 20th yet. <laughs> I have no idea when these videos will go up. But we're done. We're loading her up. So, one thing you guys didn't know, that was a walk-in hunt. I'm going to try to zoom in. You ain't, ain't going to be able to see it on this lens. Yeah, all the way out there. Right there. That's where we sat up. As you can tell, we got two stragglers here, two stragglers there. Actually, they're not stragglers. <laughs> they're, they went out for round two and just now getting back. <laughs> the bugs, dude. The, bugs. the amount of 
bugs. We small. about got carried away this morning with mosquitoes. Yes, we did. It, it was, was unbelievable, actually. And then they just went away. Yeah, they did. They just <laughs> they disappeared. Did disappeared. Yeah. Once that sun comes up, they're gone. That's crazy. Sun comes up, mosquitoes, vamanos. Oh, how dare Freddy Rico. Oh, he's a happy boy. He wasn't so happy just a minute ago. Set. In the middle of the road. Yep, just set. Uh-huh. Set. He ain't, he's too excited. He's been in the back of the truck in the kennel all morning hearing us shoot, you know, all the uh, 11 birds, 10 birds, sorry, that we shot. It was a good hunt, though. Uh, the ones that did it, they really did it. You tired? Cardio. Cardio. It's been a good guard, Nicholas. <laughs> it comes back yeah. to cardio. Strong. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, that's how I feel. Yeah. I mean, that was right out of half mile, right? Right out of half. I judge it on the level. Huh? <laughs> the power tuck. <laughs> the power tuck. <laughs> no bell. Well, we are back at camp here, back at the lodge. Uh, I just want to tell you guys, be uh, be expecting the next North Dakota video coming. I'm going to show you the inside of the lodge. You're going to meet some of the guys. Uh, I can just tell you right now, the hunts, the rest of the trip are going to be slow. Uh, this hunt right here, finally we got on them. We killed 11. We did find a straggler uh, on the other side of the field pulling out. Uh, it might have made it 12. But other than that, there's a couple things I believe that's going on up here compared to last year. Last year, as y'all remember, we got down here and uh, the first day we killed 33. The second day we killed 24. And the third day was a struggle. I think we killed like three or four but long story short there's a lot and i and i mean a ton more fields that have that are cut uh or, or just are good feed fields last year when i came the only thing available for them were cut wheat fields well now this year those same wheat fields are available but now there's these there's these corn fields that have been cut and now they're like disked over and those have a ton of corn in them and there's a lot of pea fields off as well just like this hunt right here so long story short these are not going to be pile them up uh videos but i'm trying to add knowledge in them given uh my thoughts on them some of the other guys thoughts on them just like bradley and i we've been sitting here trying to debate not only to just just kind of debate our lives but just kind of you know tr try Figure to what's going on yeah trying to get an idea and trying to both like just brainstorm and be like what's the difference because the, d the deal is we found plenty of feeds y'all plenty and like um the birds they're just i think nick said it the best old local beauty old nicholas he said bob why you always hear of early season hoggers being so quote sketchy he is he's like it isn't because you can't find the feeds and, and the numbers it's because the birds are a lot most of them are so young they they haven't patterned at all and it's so early in the season they haven't built their own pattern at all so every day they're just kind of doing what they want and kind of on their own time you know Whew. explanation number 14 over the old shirt who knows if we'll use her again but i'm telling you what on the first day that we didn't shoot anything it, it, it was it was helpful what's um what's your uh What's your, if you were to put anything as a reason for, you know, not being able to shoot the birds that we can scout and we can get permission on, what's your main number one reason? Why? Yep. Because these birds literally just learned to fly. They're still in their family groups. So they don't know what they're going to do the next day. That's what, I, that's what I just got done explaining to them. I was like, Nick said it the best. They're young. It's the beginning of the season. They haven't. They they have no rhythm to rhyme. Nothing. No pattern at all. Yeah. They have nothing to to follow each other. I mean, they don't even like to land by each other in the fields. <laughs> right. right. So <laughs> they're very territorial. We were talking about it on the way back to lodge. Uh, when they got babies, what happens? Territory. Hey, get back. Get back. So right now they're in they're in these family groups that are just spread across the field. I mean, so trying to sit five dozen decoys to, to match a hundred birds that are spread across the whole field, it's pretty tough. So when they group up, you have better luck. Now they're like, okay, my, my babies are big enough, we're gonna let them mingle amongst. That's when they get good. Yeah, 
Yeah, come like September one. Right. It'll, it'll. It's like a switch gets thrown. I'm, I I was gonna have a lot of questions and I already answered it. Uh, last season was so good. I think it's because there's so much more available food sources. Last yes. year it was just wheat. Yeah, yeah. This year we don't. Well, a lot of our wheat's still standing, but these corn we fields got all these corn fields that, cutting dissed up. Yeah, those fields. <laughs> corn fields that were cut in July and August. Ex even. Th this July and August uh -huh. from last year. Last year. Yeah, they're everywhere. Lots of options. Yeah. Lots of options. Almost too many options. I know. <laughs> I, I can promise you one thing. You may learn a couple things on these uh, on these two to three to four videos, however many we get up being up here in North Dakota. But one thing you're not going to see pile them up videos. It's not what it is this season. Uh, we have a lot of buddies, and and there's some of y'all. I know some of you guys have had some good hunts. Drop a comment down below. Let us know what was your opening day like. But big shout out to Dirty Bird, old Nicholas Matthew, hooking it up, getting us all out here. Beginning of the season. Just getting in the blind, it's nice. Just to remind you, the ducks goose calls, that's what I've been honking on the whole week. Available August 20th. Don't miss the ducks waterfowl drop. Subscribe if you haven't. Hit the notification bell down there because these videos, we, we got a few of them coming. But until next time. Fred here, come on. Place, not put right here, place. Oh, sit down, sit down, sit down. Oh, good boy. Cause I've been getting laid back, baby, you should know that I don't need your criticism, pessimism I've been keeping it on the DL, got a girl that keeps it real